Hello everyone, Esprit Architects here. Finally, the new Arcade 25 has arrived. We have been waiting for this about one year and finally expected moment has come. Let's examine together what is there and what is not. Yes, there are many new features in the latest version of Arcade 25. Some of these are the features we have all been waiting for, but you may find some of them unnecessary. Besides, let's see if the innovations presented to us after a year will be enough. First of all, I would like to talk about the best feature in my opinion. Objects hiding, smart selection features has been broke. In the oldest versions, locating an object from the floor plan and then finding the same object in the 3D or sections was pure torture. Because when we switch between views after making a selection, the selection disappears and we have to find it again later. This is outdated now. We will now control the elements view and speed up our workflow. The important deficiency that I see in this regard is that it does not work in the floor plan and section. Only option to hide in the 3D view is active. I wish we could hide the layer combinations in the floor plan with one click without touching them. Here we have an example for this. I will select this sofa in the floor plan. It will be also selected in the 3D. In addition to that, we can do this operation reverse. Right click the sofa and go with the select on floor plan. I think it's very useful and save us time in our projects. Now let's select this table. Let's just right click it and click select in 3D. As you can see, it was selected in the 3D window. Let's just right click it. And now we can click hide selection. Shortcut is Alt F5. But the real problem is it's visible in the floor plan. I just wanted to hide it in the floor plan also, but it wasn't. Unfortunately, we are going to follow the old methods in order to hide something in the floor plan. Our second feature is opening tool. The opening tool that came in the previous version only allowed secure and round. Functionally, it worked and open it like MEP, but it was limited. Sometimes it wouldn't let us when we needed to use it as polygon. As I mentioned in my previous arcade review, I said that the polygonal opening tool comes in the first version and is finally here. Now we can open spaces in the shapes we want and use them in our designs. It's not just MEP. If you remember from my tutorials, we used to make shapes with morph, subtract with boolean operation and turn off the morph layer. It won't need it anymore. Another innovation is the improvements in 2D visualization. In order to prepare effective 2D graphics, we use software such as Photoshop and took it one step further without the way we present it. Now with the shaded texture feature, we will be able to prepare our project for presentation with a few minor adjustments without workarounds. Then we can save it as a template and use it in other projects. When you consider our kit in general, we all know that it's very comprehensive program. When we bring together the interior and exterior architecture, not just the exterior architecture, we can achieve the full efficiency of building. For this reason, it is very important to support this architectural project with interior architecture. Arcade has taken this one step further and developed the object library leading us to prepare professional interior decoration projects and visuals. By developing the object library in the last two versions, it aimed to save us a bit of the trouble of searching for objects starting from the principle of time is money. Overall, it's a below average update. In my opinion, a version update could be at least one of the content that users cannot create with workgrounds alone. For example, a tool or hiding an object in the floor plan without touching the layers. Maybe they could have blocking a little simpler. Yes, there is a hot thing tool, but it's a bit cumbersome and impractical for me. 
are the updates on arcade other competitors are so great i think they are out there on this too in general this is how things are in the bim market apart from this there are other corrections and minor innovations you can review them on arcade's own website everyone is hiding a secret people somewhere and waiting for the right time to take it out